2015, when I was in third grade, my parents pulled me out of traditional schooling so I can cultivate my love of learning in the real world. While my home base remains in the beautiful San Francisco Bay Area, I now travel all over the globe throughout the years to learn in the most organic way possible. This includes so many different aspects, such as cooking classes in almost every country, where I not only get to learn new recipes, but also farming techniques, local ingredients, and how food plays a big part of the local culture. It also includes many, many museums, from contemporary art museums to local artist museums, to history museums to science museums. At any given time, my teachers can be a local historian walking me through actual historical sites, a local farmer teaching me about sustainability, an animal rights activist teaching me about animal abuse, an expert in their field, teaching me about their trade, a YouTube channel that focuses on specific topics, an online teacher from outschool.com, or a Netflix documentary that teaches me about coral reefs. I also learn so much through the books that I read, because I absolutely love to read. You'll find me reading anytime, anywhere. I'll be reading on planes, on trains, on buses, even on a picnic mat underneath the Eiffel Tower. Oh, and because life skills are important too, I'm usually the one navigating the way with maps and apps, figuring out complex subway systems, asking all the questions, helping to problem solve, exchanging local currency, and ordering all the food, sometimes in the local language. In between all the learning, I of course also get to have a ton of adventures along the way. I've snorkeled in the Great Barrier Reef in Australia, skied down the Swiss Alps in Switzerland, swam with whale sharks in Mexico, hiked the Great Wall of China, among so many other memorable things. I've made pottery in a village in Vietnam, I've watercolored in front of a beautiful church on the hillside of Colombia, I've helped to bathe elephants in an elephant sanctuary in Thailand, and I've drank ice cold water straight from a glacier. I've even deboned a fresh fish in Japan to make sashimi. Let's just say that world schooling equates to the most amazing field trips imaginable. This type of alternative education is not only teaching me a great deal of knowledge, but it's giving me the opportunity to stretch way beyond the traditional classroom walls and into a colorful, diverse world, where I get to meet friends of all ages, all colors, and all backgrounds. Here's a fun fact. One of my best friends is a world schooler that I met while traveling two years ago. Since then, I've visited her in four different countries. I hope you'll subscribe to my channel and follow along on my journey as I continue to share with you all the beautiful places, extraordinary adventures, and life learnings around the world. I also hope my videos will inspire you to keep learning beyond school hours, classroom walls, and cubicles because there really is so much to learn in the world if you'll just open your mind and your heart. Thank you so much for watching!